Well, today's Open for Business segment will keep you on your toes. Eyewitness News reporter Victoria Woodall takes us to Arabesque in Perkinsley, Pennsylvania, where the owner's passion for dancing bloomed into a business. Here's a story now to tell you all about it. Hey, young lady. Hey, you. Yes, are you familiar with the Arabesque pose? No, strike it for me. Oh, boy. Do you really want to see this belly right now? Oh. That might be too much for TV. Oh, yeah, my bad. Oh. <laughs> So, well, both arms out and one leg up. You basically create sort of like an upside down L with your lower body. Okay. But anyway, uh, I, I expect you to try that during the break. Okay, I, I will. I think you'd I have will. fun with it. <laughs> um, but in the meantime, you guys can all have such a fun time perusing and shopping an arabesque in Perkasie. It's a lovely little boutique that has all of your dancewear needs. And in particular, it's got a focus on point. And what we recognize or what we learn in this Open for Business today is what the point really is as to why they do what they do. And really, it's passion that makes this boutique stand up on its toes. Take a look. Dancers, their bodies are the tool that they need to perform. And then when you get to be on stage and you get to wear that costume, it completes what you've been working for and by putting that last stitch or that last rhinestone on it just it makes it real it makes it come alive in Perkasie this lovely little shop of dancewear received its name after this position but it got its passion from this current ballet instructor and business owner Kelly Yambellino that pink one was my tutu and that was actually the first tutu I ever wore when I was growing up. She founded her dancewear store 17 years ago after realizing what she and her dancers needed wasn't within arm's reach. You know, this was really before, you know, internet sales and um, Amazon. There wasn't a main store that had everything. When I had my classes, I thought, you know, where can we go to get product? I can't take them to Philly. We need to be here. So, at Ann Arabesque, they carry all you need from costume rentals to tights so right to steal the show, including over 50 styles of point shoes. We have product from all over the world. But here, you won't just get the perfect fit. So from years of experience, I can look at a foot and really can narrow it down to almost two shoes. A lot of times, I could probably pull the shoe the first time and be done. But that's, you know, we want to do the experience. We want the girls to learn. You'll also be in the company of dancers who just get why you love what you do, because they do too. What's the feeling when you put that last final touch on your costume? I still get excited about that. Every time I see my students perform, because um, I still am actively teaching, I cry. I feel it. You just devote so much to the art, and when you see your students kind of taking on that next step, it's it's. It's really powerful. Ballet has such a deep-rooted tradition, and I just feel that there is a connection from centuries before that has been passed down from generation to generation, and it doesn't happen that much anymore in the world. So to me, carrying on the traditions is what makes it magical. It's really the point. It's really the point. I love this shop so much, and Kelly's passion just radiates throughout the store. I mean, as she was talking, I know in my own head, I was envisioning sugar plums dancing around, and I hope you were too, because they really do have everything you need. They have everything for uh, boys and girls, for the amateurs, all the way up to those working on those point pro moves. So it's Beautiful. really fantastic, and guess what? She not only has a location in Perkasie, but more uh, in Bucks County in the Doylestown area. She has four locations, so that just goes to show you what what passion, perseverance, and good intention will get you. You get oh, yeah. back to you. No doubt. I'm gonna tell my sister to look at that story on our website. She had those point shoes all over the house growing up. Those are oh that's wonderful. Great. And Thanks you you better stretch before you uh, attempt oh, the arabesque. I'll pull a hammy in a minute. Yes, I will. That's right. what I'm saying. <laughs> that's what I'm saying. Stretch it out. Thanks, Tori. Appreciate it. I will.